Mic test, mic test. What is up, everyone? And welcome to another Tekken cosplay. But not just any Tekken cosplay. This one is one that I thought long and hard about. Because the cosplay that we are going to be doing is of somebody that is a living legend. Somebody whose music I was listening to as I grew up in it. Somebody whose music was way before my time. I'm only 28 years old. I was born in 1988. This man was... Man, he was doing it way before that. I have thought long and hard about this. Now I have looked at every character's customization and the character or rather I say the person because they say that imitation is the sincerest form of flattery, of flattery and make no mistake ladies and gentlemen this is a tribute to the great Boots and Collins. Now, with the Tekken character cosplays, I, I do my best to make the character as well as the outfit look accurate to the person that they are trying to cosplay as. In this case, there is no way, based on what the way that they made the customization option, can I make Boots and Collins 100% accurate. I am a fan of Bootsy. We can take this back to the rubber band. We can take this back to George Clinton and the Funkadelics. We can take this back to when they was called Parliament. Flashlight, don't get me started. Man. We gonna be here all day. Dabba zabba, ooh dabba zabba. You don't do, don't get me started. <laughs> do not get me started. I was raised on this man's music. Him playing the guitar with George Clinton and the Funkadelics, even when he went on his little, you know, when he went on his own for a while. Play with boots. Rubber band. The list goes on. And do and in Tekken 7, certain characters have exclusive items that only they are able to wear. Because of this, I will be using Lee to do this cosplay. Now, if a person of a person of a person of a person just so happens to get in touch with me and they lead him back to this video, Bootsy, I wanted to use a black guy. <laughs> I really did. I tried Eddie, he didn't have anything remotely close to what Lee has. I even tried Miguel. He was going to be a reach. In this case, my plan is to just get the outfit correct. That's all. I don't think Bootsy is a bad guy. I don't even think he would take an offense to it. I don't know him personally, but just based on his music and interviews that I've seen, he's a lovable guy. So I don't think he would take it any offense to me doing a cosplay of him as you know an asian fighter but lee is the only person in this game that has those fat shoes so this is how it's going to, this is how i gotta go if we're gonna get it accurate so let's get started i even make clear the space for the black outfit i made for lee but lee is what you would consider my main so meaning the, the main character that i use so i'm i i make outfits for him a lot so let's just get the outfit correct first make this as accurate as possible now i tried to do this earlier and it was kind of it was somewhat of a fail i'm, I'm, I'm gonna say because i tried to use his mane uh, or look like this jacket that he has but it was just too much going on so i ended up switching it to this of course, it's not going to be right. 
without the guitar. It may not be the star guitar. It will be a guitar. What is it? Oh, he got it on here. I know I'm not tripping. Pass it up. There it is. Boom. And last but not least, the piece that's really going to tie it all together. The glass. Because you can't have Bootsy Collins without the glass. Now, Bootsy Collins has many different colorful outfits. And I do mean many. And the outfit that I'm going to be choosing is one that he wore um, while he was uh, performing live. I'm not exactly sure where he was, but it was like a blue, silver, and violet stained glass that he had. And that's the inspiration that I'm using for this uh, this cosplay. Now, you know, Lee, his favorite color is violet. This outfit, which you're going to see in the thumbnail, is basically the same way. So I'm trying to get this as accurate as possible. It's a shame you can't change the color of the guitar, but... That's pretty much what I'm trying to aim for. First things first, let's get the, the top hat right. I was at a zoo zabba baba. Yeah, baby. So, if you've never listened to any of Bootsy Collins, just go back and listen. Just go to YouTube and type in Bootsy Collins. Trust me, you will not be disappointed. The, the, the man is a living legend for a reason. And... If I'm not careful, like I'm really going to be, man, look, like the dude is a legend, just, just look his music up. <laughs> like, I don't want to feel like I'm saying too much, doing too much, but like, yeah, like, there's somebody whose music I definitely, that definitely helped raise this being, you know, as ABS for. Definitely got to give him a shot. Anybody, if there was any musician battery load that I was going to give a tribute hit most definitely gotta give it to Bootsy glasses that he has in this picture that I'm looking at They're like silver on the side oh it's weird I, I can't think the rims are silver this part is like purple. So make that blue. So, right there. That's what we got. His hat, I kind of wish they would let you change that band that's on the hat, but they don't let you do that. So, or I mean, we could go with the fedora, but he's more known for having like the top hat. So, let's go with that. The hat that he has in a, he actually has a feather in his hat, but let's just make it purple. Um, now this is going to be a crazy color to try to emulate. So we got a, actually a, a lot to go with. First thing, let's, let's change this collar. He's going to pretend like that's like his necklace, his silver necklace that he has on in the picture. These lines. I wish you That's what you give me if you hear like door slamming in the back. Um obviously I can't duplicate hundred percent what he has on in this. But it's in, but the color scheme I'm gonna be using for this is actually inspired by what I'm seeing right now. So um so yeah. We got that. Uh, actually, this color blue actually got to change. Take it 
kind of like that. Is actually see that what purpose that it is. Fine. Change that. Over. I'm not satisfied with it. What do you mean, just so? a lot of things up with the colors. kind of going with kind of hard to pull off literally he's the only one with stacked shoes in the game <laughs> I don't know who else could have pulled this cosplay off no I'm not going to give him a tan look because that's blackface and we damn know it's or nothing like that nah that's blackface nah we'll pass him there's no way for me to change his hair color underneath the cap. I mean, underneath the hat to that. So, outfit, purple, silver, and blue. This right here is purple, silver, and blue. I feel like we can make that jacket here.
I don't want to just do like that. I feel like this top is going to end up getting all the attention. I don't want the pants just like there. Since he has some nice outfit. But here just kind of looks like plain Jane. Ain't falling. Like I wonder if I should do it like red and black. This booty had like quite a few outfits. He had one that was that was that was yellow and black. One that you know he had ones that's multicolored. A lot of his outfits were very outlandish. Um, but then again, back in the days, like they actually put a lot of effort in, in, into what they wore when they performed. So this definitely is known for. So for those of us who are fans of his work, this most definitely is um, known for his outfit. He performed, everything was a show, including what he had on. better than what I thought it was going to look like. You know, these colors are kind of dull compared to what but... Ah. Don't try to get this right. I don't want to mess this up. I really don't. Anybody playing will probably get blinded. I think it's fine though. Huh. Well, I think something off. Something's off and things with the pants. Let me try to do like a color swap. Let's make silver. Definitely think I would want to Well, the shoes are fine. But we don't need to mess with the shoes. Pretty much the color scheme for this.
especially though half of y'all don't even know who the hell Bootsy Collins is. So I told you to look him up. And then a God amongst ants. You know what it was in a Magneto record? It don't look too bad. Actually, I think it was fun. Uh, look at that. I, got, I, I want some, some silver to be in there. Just a hint at the jacket. But I don't know. It's just like it's not fully coming together. I did want the bottom to be blue. I did want that to be blue. This is the point. It wouldn't be bad if I left the score right here. This is fine. Actually, that's not too bad. I do is give him my own. <laughs> I know, just the one. Okay, that arm sticking through that thing kind of messes it up, but that we can get there. Ladies and gentlemen, that is Lee as Bootsy Collins. Like I said, I, I wanted to use somebody else, but nobody else has the stack shoes. Lee is the only one. Now, I, I never used the stack shoes before anyway, and it was just a thought. You know, there's many more of these Tekken co character cosplays coming up soon, so you guys make sure to subscribe, like, comment, all that good stuff, and stay up to date with everything I'm doing on the channel. So, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Peace. And nobody does Tekken character cosplays like I do. Check the playlist.